We want to bring you an update now to breaking news we first told you about earlier in this newscast. Selma police are investigating a hit and run crash involving a little boy. Action News reporter Rick Montanez is live at the scene with the very latest. Rick. And Sarah, we're told it was a six-year-old boy that was struck by a car and dragged. The Selma police chief says the accident happened about a block away from where we are. He says they're not exactly sure how far the boy was dragged, but we have investigators near the intersection here where we are. So again, about a block away. And we're told that investigators are now looking for that driver who struck the boy. Let's show you some video of the scene from just a few moments ago. Police have much of the area closed off for several blocks in all directions near this crash scene. Now, Chief Myron Dick says officers are talking to several witnesses who saw the driver. One woman told me a neighbor helped the boy and they think he has several broken bones as a result of this crash. Police say several people saw the driver who hit the child and left. At this time, we have a, uh, some description and some possible leads on a vehicle and a person. We are looking into that right now. And police are using that information. They say they may know who the driver is, so they are not releasing that information to the public at this point. But the chief told me if they need help in tracking down this driver, they will, of course, release that information to us. We will, uh, of course, bring you more information on ABC30.com and Action News AM Live. That's the latest live in Selma. Rick Montanez, ABC30 Action News.